attention and please take this seriously. We made a commitment to the people of this country that we will be serious and will avoid certain things that will bring the image of this institution in disrepute. It has come to my attention that some MDAs, some ministries, some agencies and departments of government are making arrangements with our own committees and financing them to do certain work. If you want your mandate and authority and independence eroded, let somebody else other than parliament finance your activities. He who pays the piper calls the tune. Honorable members, very, very seriously, it's a trend that is dangerous for this institution. I am calling upon all ministries all agencies of government and departments of government to seize forthwith from these dealings which will eventually end up undermining the independence of this institution. This communication should be made in writing and copied to all persons to whom this particular guidance or directive is given. And this is the first directive I am giving in my whole history as both deputy speaker and speaker, this is the first directive I am giving. No ministry, no agency of government, and no department of government shall finance the activities of committees of parliament because doing so will end up undermining the independence and the authority of this institution. Chairpersons, Vice Chairpersons,